Hey, good morning everybody and welcome to ShortSalePowerHour.com. I'm Fred, this is Kevin, and let's jump right into it. It's Mindset Monday and some of your mindsets suck. Wow, okay. Not everybody's, but... I just said some. No, 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 In some. fact, the some aren't watching, but I, just, I mean, I figured they, out, You know what? That's get true. Get right to it today. Let's were, jump right in. If they were watching, they wouldn't have the crappy mindset that they have. No, they would at all. Yeah. So. Yeah. I'm taking shots and I'm getting your attention early. So here's yeah. the deal. Um, I, you know, <laughs> there's no other way to say it, but there's a lot of whining uh, in the short sale industry. It's not new. It's been around for a while. But today on Mindset Monday, we're going to take a challenge and um, kind of post up that whiny mindset around why don't things get better? Why don't the banks improve their processes? Why do they always foreclose on properties? Why do they ask for contributions you know what? from my side? I just realized we could cut this video very short, do it in about a minute. It, just by talking about the couple of things that you and I chatted about earlier today, which is, yeah. look, if you understand short sales and you understand that it's up to you to beat the system, and I said beat the system, not work the system, not work with the system, Correct. not work in the system. Beat not, it. Not Crush it, things. kill it, beat it upside down and backwards. Yeah, but actually beat the Take system. Take advantage of it. If you're one Abuse of the few it. that will do that, then you want nothing else to change. And if you're the 98% of people that want things to get better and want the bank's process to get better and wants the banks to come out with new ideas that are gonna help us close short sale faster and they're gonna help us get leads from them, then guess what? You're never going to close more short sales than you are. You're always gonna close 30, 40, maybe 50% on a good day. And that's not good enough for your clients. I hope you feel good. I hope you, I, I hope you don't feel good actually when you look a client in the eye and you have that conversation with them about hey, I'm gonna help you out, and you really have a coin flip maybe of helping them out. But for those of us who have a mindset of going, hey, I'm gonna beat the system, I'm going to get things done, I, yeah. things Here, are good, here's the is good, the short sale world is perfect. Here's my mindset summary, we're gonna say it differently, but, but here's, the, here's the summary, guys. Stop trying to have everything get fixed and all your problems go away and start embracing them as the competitive advantage that sets you apart. Because you know that out there in the industry, doesn't matter if we're talking real estate or we're talking restaurants or what doesn't matter what industry we're talking about, people stop when problems show up. They hope their problems will go away rather than yeah. overcoming and being victorious and getting around their problems. They just stop dead in their tracks and they whine and they complain and it comes out lots of different ways but they ultimately want it to be fixed and change, okay? It's what goes on in our government and our world today when people look at politics. But instead of hoping for these big changes, start impacting your world, start impacting your economy, start seeing the problems that exist specifically in short sales as your competitive advantage over all the other competition as your unfair share, as your ability to get more listings and close more listings while everybody else is running around wanting the government and the financial committees and HUD and Fannie and Freddie to change things, just start beating the system because when you're producing top results, it won't matter what everybody else is doing. And if they change and they get better, guess what? Fine, your life just got easier too. But in the meantime, don't put your energy and attention over there. Embrace your competitive advantage. See obstacles and problems in the short sale world. And instead of thinking, I wish they'd get better, think, I'm glad they're this way because it's what sets me apart and makes me better in my business than everybody else. Period. End of story. Have a great day. See you Wednesday. See you on Wednesday. Wednesday. One, two, three. Short sale power hour. Short sale power hour. Crush it. Oh, I couldn't turn it on.